What's up, you guys? This is Divine Messenger 33. Where I get messages from the divine and I give them straight to you guys. So clearing out any energy that would not benefit this message. Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, my ancestors, my spirit guides of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel the current energies. Ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Clear and accurate messages. Welcome all my supporters. I appreciate you guys for liking and commenting and subscribing to the channel. I appreciate all of the love, the support, the donations, the bookings, the emails, all of the positivity that you guys have been showing. I appreciate you. And all the services that I provide will be down below in the description box. All right. All right, y'all. Let's see what's going on in the energy. See what's going on with y'all. All right, Spirit, what's the message? All right, drop your shield. All right, drop your shield, okay? Time to reflect in a situation. All right, yeah. Divine could be wanting you to drop your shield because... I feel like you could have manifested a new romantic cycle for some of you guys, uh, but you need to drop your shield towards it though. Okay, I feel. All right, divine with you to trust your instincts because you are a wise, a wise one. Okay, yeah. So that's what I'm getting. Okay, it's a new romantic cycle. Some of you guys could be blocking because you need to drop your defenses here. All right. For some of you guys, or just drop your defenses, period. Uh, maybe when it comes to like starting something, okay, start a new project or something like that. All right, let's see what the ancestors want, okay. The ancestors want you to connect with the animals, you can have a animal spirit around you a pet that could have passed away okay this animal could be around you at this time yeah interact and relate here remember who you are okay so you could be needing to interact with your loved one some kind of way um community family uh traditions um some of you guys could be trying to really figure out who you are here like your talents, you know, some people could be uh, trying to figure that out, okay, in a situation. But you could have like a very, um, a very good connection, like with animals and stuff like that. All right, so, all right, so at the top of this deck, we have the Ten of Wands, okay, in this deck, okay, as you can see, this person is dropping, giving up. So somebody could be giving up on a situation here, okay. Dropping the burdens. Okay. Dropping the burdens. Okay, we're going to get into it and see what's going on. Dropping the burdens. All right, Spirit. What is this? Dropping the burdens here. What is this? Ten of Pentacles. All right. What else? Six of Wands in reverse. Okay, so somebody didn't have a victory when it came to a Ten of Pentacles situation. All right, yeah. Somebody had poured out their emotions for a situation. Okay, that's what I feel. Yeah, that's what I feel. Somebody didn't have a victory with a Ten of Pentacles situation. Yeah, instead, they got a Ten of Swords. Yeah, they got a painful ending. So somebody didn't get what they thought they was going to get. Okay. Yeah, 
whatever that they was working on here eight of pentacles yeah it caused a lot of chaos and conflict though that you know it's keeping they gotta have a lot of strength to uh fight this uh chaos and conflict so somebody could have thought that they was gonna get a victory in something they didn't it just caused a lot of confusion a lot of chaos in their life queen of cups all right six of cups in reverse ace of swords yeah so i feel like with the queen of cups this could be a, a person that shows up as like they're lovable here okay but this person could have been secretly trying to do something here to get a ten of pentacles okay uh some clarity could have came through all right in a situation to somebody and somebody didn't have a victory somebody could have had some clarity and it could have stopped something here yep king of swords all right yeah okay so what i'm getting is i'm gonna clarify y'all but what i'm getting is there's a queen of cups energy this could be a baby mama or this could just be a person that shows up as queen of cups yeah i feel like this person had a tower moment and they are in their head right now because i feel like this person really thought that they was going to get a ten of pentacles but they was not in victorious energy it, it wasn't victorious okay it wasn't victorious okay yep I feel like somebody got the clarity and I feel like somebody could have cut something off and move forward, okay, in a situation. Yeah, whatever somebody cut off here, it gave them a ten of pentacles. Yeah, knight of wands. Yep, this could be a situation with the knight of wands, ten of cups, and the king of swords. This could be a, a on and off connection. Like, knight of wands is like an in and out kind of energy okay so i feel like this is an on and off kind of situation could be all right but somebody got some clarity and i feel like yeah somebody got some clarity about something here all right let's see clarify ten of pentacles clarify ten of pentacles high priestess so I feel like somebody is holding some knowledge back on how they, how they're getting the Ten of Pentacles. This Emperor, okay, this Emperor could be holding back how they're getting their Ten of Pentacles, how they are getting their money. Okay, I feel like this person <clears throat> is, they got some wisdom. They got some hidden wisdom on how they got this done or how they're doing this here or how they were trying to go about doing this here. But I feel like with the hangman, I feel like, yeah, I feel like they could have had a new perspective towards something secretly. And that's how this person is getting their Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like this person uh, shift their perception uh, in a situation. Um, and it could have like, like, I feel like released something here for some people. Or this is what they wanted it wanted to happen. Okay. Six of wands in reverse. Clarify six of wands in reverse. Yeah. We got the higher five nine of cups. Yeah. I feel like in a situation, somebody could have did something here. Or this could be a situation too. Somebody thought they was going to get a victory on you and then it was like a plot twist in a situation and you could have got your wishes fulfilled with your two of cups, okay? So let's say it's a situation where somebody was trying to work against you or something like that, okay? I feel like you could have gotten, um, some of you guys, your union is guided by a, um, some kind of ancestor here, okay? Um, it's, it's guided by like a ancestor or something like that, a spirit. And I feel like somebody could have tried to end this for you 
for you guys or whatever this is okay um or take your victory or whatever like this but i feel like it could have been a plot twist and this could have turned around and hurt somebody so somebody felt like they had it like oh i got this ten of pentacles i got a way to secretly get this uh all this this ten of pentacles okay i got a secret way to get this but it didn't work okay it wasn't successful here ten of swords clarify ten of swords yeah it was like a plot twist in the situation is what i'm getting this was like a plot twist y'all ten of swords yeah four of pentacles yeah i feel like somebody could have been trying to hold on too tight to somebody and i feel like it caused the ten of swords okay um Somebody could have been trying to like hold on to somebody, be real controlling and stuff like that. And somebody could have got the healing that they needed in the situation. All right. And I feel like this person could have been looking at something with the four of cups, like, you know, so let's say if this is a situation where somebody was trying to get with somebody for money or trying to keep somebody for money or whatever like that. And somebody could have felt like they had some hidden knowledge on how to get the ten of pentacles from somebody or keep the ten of pentacles with somebody and i feel like this person was like you know they really felt like they was gonna get a victory but i feel like i feel like that this happened at the last minute like this person could have thought that they really had something and it turned around and somebody else got the victory in the situation okay kind of like at the last minute all right yeah that's what i feel i feel like that with the four of pentacles somebody have control or somebody has something on real tight or something like that yeah three of swords and the shrimp card i feel like somebody is like heartbroken suffering grief but I feel like somebody still has strength to hold on to somebody. I feel like this is a situation, like I said, this is an on and off like relationship. Like somebody constantly, like they come in and out, you know, in a situation. But I feel like this person is still going to hold on with whatever they got to do. Even if they got to like hit up a witch here. Okay. The whatever witch that I feel like this person could have hit up, hit up. I feel like this is a very experienced witch here, okay? You got the Queen of Wands and a Hermit. That's giving me a person as the uh, powerful witch here, very experienced, okay, in a situation. And I feel like this person wanted to hold on to this person so bad that for some of y'all, they could have went to this powerful uh, person here and they paid a whole lot of money to get this person, to get them to come back to them okay that's what i feel and i feel like it could have broke somebody's heart here okay um yeah it really could have broke somebody's heart that's what this could be too eight of pentacles clarify eight of pentacles yeah i feel like somebody was looking at what they was working on and with the eight of cups somebody could have emotionally walked away somebody could have left somebody behind to take a leap of faith and work on something else, okay? Ace of Pentacles, okay? Some about a new adventure or something that somebody is excited about, okay? So I feel like this situation could be too, like uh, for some of y'all, somebody could have left somebody and went back to somebody that they feel like that they could earn a lot of money with that they could do a lot with so this could be a situation too y'all where somebody could have left somebody and went back to somebody because of money purposes okay financial okay i'm hearing that it's easier to it's easier with this person financially may not be emotionally or spiritually but it's easier with this person on a um, financial level okay queen of cups clarify queen of cups Yeah, Emperor. Exactly. Yeah, this Queen of Cups is real focused on this Emperor. Yes, she is. This baby mama here. 
Yep, exactly. This person was doing magic. What did I tell y'all? You got the magician and the empress, and you got the chariot. This person is doing magic, so things can move forward. Okay? Period. Okay, and I feel like they went to a very powerful person to get it done. Six of Cups in reverse. Clarify Six of Cups. Clarify Six of Cups. Exactly. This King of Wands star card. Yeah. I feel like For some of you guys, I feel like this could be a situation where this person is still healing. So let's say if this is a situation where this is like a baby mama, somebody could have been in the midst of being separated or divorced. And I feel like in a situation, this baby mama was so desperate to get this person and keep this person because the person that this person was leaving, um, the, the man, like I said, this is a man getting a divorce. He had all the money. He was the breadwinner. And this baby mama is, like, desperate to hang on to this person. So I feel like this person was like, okay, I'm going to make another attempt. I'm going to hit up somebody that's real strong, that, you know, been doing this for years, to get this person back to me and all this other shit. Because I feel like this king of wands is still healing. This person is still going through a lot of healing. And I feel like this person could be still have some feelings for this person, but I feel like that this person is, like, they was hanging on to this person. Yep, that's what I feel. I feel like there could have been a few people involved and in trying to block a love offer and trying to slow stuff down and close a cycle and make it so somebody could miss an opportunity and put their blocks up. Okay, that's what I feel. Yep, because this King of Wands energy this person is still healing this could be a natural born leader entrepreneur stuff like that career uh focused individual this person is still going through some healing okay and i feel like somebody is using like this per person being vulnerable to like keep this person like caged up you know what i mean ace of swords clarify ace of swords clarify ace of swords yeah this Queen of Pentacles had a new idea. Okay, this Queen of Pentacles energy, this person made a decision. Uh, somebody could be bisexual as well, or this could have something to do with the same sex. But I feel like somebody got some clarity and made a decision to do something because this person could have had a lot on their shoulders. And so this person was trying to figure out what role to take to keep their foundations and to end a love offer that somebody was trying to give somebody here. Yep, that's what I feel, y'all. Clarify Chariot. Clarify Chariot. Yep. Yep, so someone made a decision to move forward. Yep. In a situation. What else about this Chariot spirit? Yep. This Emperor could have made a decision to travel to this empress okay this could be a baby mom or something like that that was doing magic okay to move forward with them exactly this person with the five of swords was trying to win at all costs so they contacted this this witch here so they can get a victory and i feel like that they uh could have got a message that um this cult leader here this person that they hit up is causing is causing forward movement for them Okay, I feel with this uh, King of Swords energy, King of Wands. All right, clarify King of Swords. Clarify King of Swords. Yeah, King of Swords, Queen of Swords. Ace of Pentacles. I feel like this is a situation where at the end of it all, somebody will be with their divine counterpart. King of Swords, Queen of Swords, okay? Um, two people that's very intelligent, two people that speak the truth, Ace of Swords, there will be some communication, okay? And there will be leaps of faith. So I feel like this is a situation where, like I said, it's like a plot twist. So I'm gonna sum it up for y'all. So basically, this is a situation where somebody is in desperate need to hold on to somebody. Somebody is secretly trying to get the Ten of Pentacles with somebody, okay? Or keep the Ten of Pentacles with somebody, 
I feel like this person could have hit up a very powerful person um, to get this done. Um, for some of y'all, it worked. Okay. For some of y'all, this did work in a situation. Um, but I feel like there, there is going to be some clarity that come in about this person here, about this wife about this girlfriend, whoever this is, there will be some clarity that comes in and then somebody will make a decision and go forward with their real divine counterpart. Okay, King of Swords, Queen of Swords. And they will have a passion, a new beginning with this person. Okay, but I feel like currently right now, okay, somebody could be up under like a lot of a spell, a, like a strong spell. Okay, because somebody was trying to win at all costs because I feel like they roll was hard. So they was like, okay, I'm going to hit up this powerful ass witch. Okay, in a situation to end, to end some shit, to slow some shit down and to completely end some shit. Okay, yeah. So that's what I'm getting. Yep, so if y'all, because you could have probably seen some, um, some changes, some differences within your connection. Um, like if y'all started not to really talk that well to each other or whatever this is, like stuff just was like getting worse and worse to the point where for some of y'all, y'all not even talking to this person at all or whatever this is. Okay. This may only be for one person here. All right. Somebody could like TV series or been on a TV series. So the signs we have are. We got Pisces, Cancer, Taurus. We got a lot of Cancer. Aquarius, Gemini, Capricorn. All right. Yeah. Somebody can have long eyelashes or like wearing long eyelashes. Yeah, so somebody hit up someone very powerful here. That's what I feel engaged so somebody is going to be getting engaged to somebody or something like that sports or this could have been a situation where this person they was trying to block an engagement because they knew that this person was going to want to be with you be with you and they could have hit up this powerful person to stop this person from coming towards some of y'all love and or romantic movies that's how I feel so they hit up somebody Real powerful. Like I said, the Queen of Wands and the Hermit, that's that is a powerful person. Beer, somebody could drink. So yeah, that's what I'm getting. But pharmacists, street pharmacists. I don't know how y'all gonna feel though, because I mean with a painful ending, this is like mm -hmm. I don't know how y'all gonna feel about this. Blue jean. I feel like at the end of it all, you are you will get the opportunity of being with this person, but it's up to you all if you want to still be with this person. Okay, like when they do, when this does break here, because I do feel like this person is gonna get some kind of clarity. And I feel like this person gonna try to run towards you for some of y'all. It's gonna be like a, a run. Short curly hair. But I don't know if you gonna be willing to accept this person back though. Once this break, I don't know. Social media platform. Yeah, I don't know. Cause for some of y'all, like I said, this is like an in and out kind of situation. So, her coat. Yeah, somebody hit up somebody powerful as fuck. That's what I'm getting, y'all. Long nails. And that ten of wands could have been you giving up. That could have been you giving up. Like, you dropping the burdens on the situation. Like, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't about to be dealing with this shit, you know? Like, you know what I'm saying? Mental health issues. Yeah, I feel like this person, they wasn't trying to, uh-uh. They weren't trying to let this person go. Single. So some of you guys could be single. Even though 
even if you are dating that's still considered single because you're not like with nobody or whatever singer like committed to nobody like you know what i'm saying like on that level Something about a Chevy. Leather jackets. Yeah, that's what I feel, y'all. Yeah, this person did some po a powerful spell to get this person back. And like I said, for some of y'all, it worked. Right arm tattoos. Manager. Lever. Like I said, there will be justice in a situation. Some about lazy. Yeah, because I feel like, like I said, this person role was her and they lazy and they depend on this person for money. Okay, Ten of Pentacles. Some about a flight. Person that take a lot of flights. Keep telling y'all. Some about foreign. Somebody could be foreign, drive a foreign. That's what I feel, y'all. Okay, so we have Leo. Yeah, this person not loving for real. Freckles. Leggings. Some about fast food. Somebody could be eating a lot of. Yeah. So this was po a powerful spell, what I'm getting. Somebody could be in their 20s. Yeah, they got them. That's what I'm getting with this reading. Whoever they hit up, shit. Right-handed, somebody could be. Somebody could like coffee. Love drinking coffee. Somebody could do a lot of working. Work a lot. Somebody could have a convertible vehicle. All right. Bottom of the deck. Somebody could be a drug addict. Yeah, y'all, so... That's what I'm getting with this energy. That's what I'm getting, y'all. Yeah. All right, spirit. Give me some initials for this energy. V. Number five, something about mayor or Taurus. Okay, you have T, Z, O, nine. So you have September or you have Virgo, W, N, L, S, one, January or Capricorn. Four, you got Aries or April. Okay, you have D. Three, March or Pisces could be significant. All right, so. All right, you guys. So just apply what fit and leave the rest in the situation. I really hope this helped you of some sort. Actually, let me pull like a, I wanna pull one of these, y'all. Romance angel real quick. I'm going I'm to close it out with a romance angel. Give me romance angel for this situation, spirit. Give me a romance angel. Exactly. Deception. Separation. We're just going to end it there. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below to see the services that I provide. And with that, you guys, peace.
in love. This person was definitely false. Wearing a false mask in this shit. 